I'm Joanna Padilla. And I'm Hugo Alvarez. I want to take a look into responsibility until getting to school in time. Hi, I'm Giovanni Padilla, and I'm here with Ms. Lancido. Good the, morning. The, the principal of Godinas. And we're going to talk about tardiness. Okay. And so, how do you feel about tardies? Well, tardies are something in life that really just can't happen. If you have a job and you frequently go tardy to your job, your employer is going to decide that you don't need to be working there. If you go to an airplane, an airplane doesn't wait for you to get there, saying, oh, well, Gio Giovanni's not here yet, so we'll just wait until he gets on the plane. Um, it shows responsibility. It shows a commitment in that what you're doing is important. So it's something out of respect and something that's just a life skill that you need to be on time. Actually, a little early for anything that you need to go to. Do you think there should be anything changed in the tardy system? No, I just think students should be more responsible and get up early. And I know sometimes they have problems with their parents driving them to school on time, but then they need to have a conversation with their parents, perhaps altering their schedule so that they can come here early. We're open at 7 in the morning, so there's really no excuse to be tardy. But I think that unless there's um, some sort of consequence or at least a warning that goes with it. It's easy for students to lay in bed and just think, oh, this pillow feels so comfortable. I can wait 10 more minutes. So that's why I don't think we should change the policy. And is there any advice you give to the frequent, frequent tardies? Um, I think one is to really look at this as a learning experience, that it's not just school that you need to be on time for, it's life. And if you don't get into that good habit now, you're only going to have problems in the future, so it's better to take care of the problem now, figure out what's going on at home so that you can get here on time and, and you know, make sure that you're here. All right. Thank you, Ms. Hi, I'm Javon Padilla. I'm here with Marco Devaro, student of Godinas. And is there a reason why you're always tired? Yeah, it's because my mom's car broke down and I couldn't find a way to get school. So my mom told her friend to take me. And that's why we're always late because we usually leave like at 7.30 and I usually get here like at 8. Is there any other way you can fix that? The only way I can fix it is if I get up more earlier than I used to and take the bus, go walking, use my bike. That's the only way. Alright, thank you. Alright, that'll be it. And make sure you get to school on time and you follow the bright rules.